Welcome to 9.30 spin. I'm Erin. <laughs> Wait for people to come on. Is this where we go from the corner? Yeah. We're a little early this morning. Yeah, so all of my playlists have been posted to the page, but you're welcome. Hi, Mom. <laughs> You're welcome to use your own playlists as well. And um, if you use a different platform for your music, I posted screenshots in the comments. Good morning, Carly. Um, yeah, so I'll tell you guys when I'm starting the playlist and you'll just start your music with me and then I'll keep you up to date throughout the class. Can you guys hear me okay? If you don't mind commenting. Good morning, Sydney. Just giving me a thumbs up if you can hear me. Thank you. I'll try to talk a little bit louder too. Thank you, Sandra. Okay, yeah, so um, we're gonna do a 50 minute spin class today. And like I said, um, I have all of the music posted in the comments of my last post, as well as a link to Apple Music and to Spotify. So depending on what you use, hopefully one of those will work. Um, I'll let you know when to hit play uh, for the playlist. Um, throughout this class, we have lots of different drills, but they will all work for um, spin bike, treadmill, or elliptical, so whatever equipment that you're using at home, um, you'll be able to modify it to work for um, whatever you have. So, I think I will just get started with the warm-up here. So, um, for the warm-up, we're just going to hit play on that song in just a second. And I'll tell you when to add a little bit of tension, but just warm up as you would. And then after our warm up, we'll get started with kind of the more um, planned drills. So the first song uh, is Give Me Your Love. And we'll just hit play right now. So when you're ready, go ahead and hit play. And we'll just get started on this warm up. I'll try to talk louder throughout this class just in case the spin bike is too loud. All right, and just getting started on a light tension. Shoulders are down away from your ears. Elbows are in, neutral spine, pushing into those heels. Strong, even pedal strokes. And we'll get ready to add our first quarter turn of gear or however much feels right to you. Uh, right here, just go ahead and add a little bit of tension. Good morning, Trisha. And we will just slowly start to build up this tension, just getting ourselves ready for this 50 minute class. And as the class goes, if you ever need a recovery, please listen to your body, take recoveries as you need them. Join back in whenever you're ready. It's totally up to you. This is your ride. 
Feel free to modify any of the songs as well. Or sorry, as, as many of the drills as well. Good morning. Awesome. All right, let's add another uh, little bit of tension, about a quarter turn or so. Depending on what bike you have, feel free to add a little bit more if that feels better. Driving through those heels, strong, even pedal strokes. Keep your core engaged. I haven't been on a swim bike in so long, it feels so strange, in a good way. <laughs> All right, finish this off. Maybe pick up your speed just a little bit here. Finish up warming those legs up, and we're going to get into a sprint coming up in just a few seconds. Awesome, grab a little bit of water. Our next song is Shots by Imagine Dragon. So this song is going to be a sprint. We're going to start off as a race pace. So um, if you're on a treadmill or elliptical, you're just gonna start off moderate, about a six to seven out of 10 effort. And then when we sprint, you're gonna build that up into a sprint. Um, same with spin, we're going to start off at a race pace and then we're going to build that into a sprint. So a 10 out of 10 effort race pace will be more of like a six or seven out of 10. All right, so go ahead and add that tension. Let's start that song over, Shots by Imagine Dragons, our second song. Start it over right now and we're starting at that race pace. I was going to adjust the music, but I realized it's on my earphones. Awesome, so just make sure that you have a good speed going that you can maintain, and then we're gonna build this right into our sprint. First sprint is coming up. As our song starts to build, you'll hear it. We're gonna bring this into a sprint right here. Go ahead and build that up. You are working at your nine to 10 out of 10. It's just a short bit. Awesome, hold that sprint. Keep going. <laughs> Thank you, Laura. Good morning, McKinley. Hi, Kayla. Awesome, keep going. Hold it here. Our sprint is about a minute long. Push, push. All right, slow it back down. We're back at that race pace. If you do need a recovery, please feel free to take it. Join back in once you are ready. Again, that race pace is a six to seven out of 10. So depending on what you are on, just adjust that so that it's your six out of 10 effort, or six to seven out of 10 effort level. We're getting ready to build that into our second sprint. This one will take us right to the end of the song. In four, three, two, one. Right here, bring it up. Push, push, push. We are here right to the end of the song. All out effort, nine to 10 out of 10. You're pushing yourself here. Those legs should be warm. Go, go, go. Awesome job, 30 seconds, hang on to it. Don't stop, don't stop. Push, push. And 
to recover. Nice work, everybody. Grab a sip of water, take your recovery. We're going to go into a climb now. This song is called Believer by Imagine Dragons. So we're going to do this, depending on what you're on, you can make adjustments, but we're going to start in a climb seated. For, my, uh, for the spin bike, during the chorus of the song, we're going to add extra tension, and you can either say seated or standing. If you're on a treadmill or elliptical, for the chorus, you're gonna want to uh, make it a little bit steeper, or you could even do it where you just run faster, whatever is best for you, but you're going to just alternate from the chorus and uh, the verses. So we're going to start with maybe about a half or a full turn of tension. You're working right around um, a heavier gear, so you're slowing it down, but then for the chorus, you're gonna make it heavier or steeper, if that makes sense, okay? and I'll let you know when to do that. So let's hit play on Believer, and let's get right into it. So add that tension, slow down your RPM. Moderately heavy right now. Again, keeping an eye on that posture, shoulders are down. Chest is up, pushing into the heels. All right, so you're going to want to start adding that gear and get ready for that chorus right here. Three, two, climb. Heavier tension or a steeper hill. You want that chorus to be nice and hard. Nice. Keep going. Three, two, one. Right when that chorus is over, take a little tension down. If you do need a recovery at any time, take it. If you don't need it yet, then you're just back into that lighter climb. Our second steeper climb is coming up in five, four, three, two, one. Add that gear. Make that second chorus heavier again. Strong, even pedal strokes. You got this. Push. Challenge yourself. Right to the top. Keep going. Three, two, one. Slow it down. Take that tension down. We've got one more heavy climb just like that coming up. Get ready to add that tension. This one takes us right to the end of our song. In five, four, three, two, one. Add your gear all out. Nice and heavy, nice and steep. Whatever you're doing, make it challenging for yourself. Finish off this song. Push. Nice work. I love this song. And when it finishes, recover. Good morning, everybody who has just joined. Thanks for joining me. All right, grab some water. We're going into a sprint. So we're going to start at a race pace similar to what we did before. This one alternates a little bit more than the uh, shot song did. So you're gonna start at a race pace again. If you're on a treadmill, start at a jog, and then you're gonna pick it, in, or pick it up into a sprint if that works for you. Um, again, make adjustments, whatever is fit for you. I'll let you know when the song adjusts, but it's during the chorus that 
uh, we're going to be sprinting, so you'll kind of be able to hear it. This is Better Days. Um, that's a song that we're going to start. So we'll start it right now in three, two, one, and you're going to be at a race pace to start. So go ahead and add a little bit of tension, working right around your seven to eight out of 10 effort. And then when we sprint, you wanna bring that into your nine to 10 out of 10 all out effort. First sprint comes in about 35 seconds or so, just so you're ready for it. Remember that you're pushing into those heels and make sure that you have enough tension on the bike that you're not going to be bouncing in that saddle. First sprint coming up in about 10 seconds. You'll hear that song start to pick up. All right, right here, pick it up. First sprint, drive those heels to the ground. Nine to 10 out of 10 effort. Pushing hard here. Push, pull, push, pull. If you're on that treadmill, sprint it out. Three, two, one, slow it back down. Race pace. Try to keep going and take your recovery a little bit later if you can. Race pace here. And then we'll have a sprint and then we'll recover. Round two coming up. Start picking up that pace. Right here, second sprint. Push, push, push. Keep going. Nice job, team. Keep it up. Push, pull, push, pull. Hang on to it. So, so good. Slow it down. Take this quick recovery, 10 seconds off. And then we'll build this back up into our last sprint. Third sprint coming up, start building it up. Start picking up that speed again. If you took tension off, add it back. All out to the end of the song. In three, two, one, last sprint, let's go. Right to the end of the song. Use that momentum, finish it off, push. Awesome, right to the end, 10 seconds. Push, push. Three, two, one. Awesome, awesome job, grab some water. Good morning, Kelly. I think that says Kelly. Guys, this is kind of far from my face because I'm so tall. So I can't always see it. So if I get off the bike, it's just so that I can read what you're saying in case can everybody hear me okay? I should probably have checked that a little sooner. Um, I checked it at the beginning, but now that I'm like breathing. <laughs> hey. <laughs> okay, um, hopefully you can hear me. If you can't, just let me know and I'll try to talk louder. Hopefully it's not just my breathing. Okay, we are going into a climb. So this is gonna grow time-wise as well as um, intensity. So you are going to start with a one minute climb it's a moderate climb, you're just gonna have a little bit of tension on the bike, maybe about a half to a full turn, depending on what kind of bike you have, or on your treadmill, add a little bit of an incline. We're gonna go for one minute, and then you're gonna get 30 seconds off, then we're gonna go for two minutes, heavier tension or a steeper incline, and then we're gonna get 30 seconds recovery, and then we're going to finish off with a four minute um, drill, heaviest that we've done, or steepest that we've done depending on what you're doing, okay? So one, then that doubles to two, then that doubles to four minutes. Okay, let's get started. The first song is Feel Me by Selena Gomez, and then it's the next three songs in a row. So you're just gonna let the playlist play and it will just carry you through, okay? So let's hit start on the Selena Gomez song, Feel Me, 
and let's get started adding that tension. We are here for one minute. I've started my timer. If you would like to start yours, we're going for one minute. You want to have about a half to a full turn. It's just a moderate climb as we're going to be adding tension throughout the whole drill. So don't start too heavy, but you want it to be a challenge for yourself. Strong, even pedal strokes. Find that beat. Left, right, left, right. Good morning. Oh, I don't think it's been a problem. All right, keep going. Three, two, one. Take a 30 second recovery here. Grab some water if you need it. We're heading into our two minute climb coming up in 15 seconds. For this second climb, you want it to be a little bit heavier. So we're gonna add on my bike, on the Schwinn, I'm adding about a quarter or a half turn of gear. For you, if you need to add a little bit more, you just want it to be noticeably heavier, but not too hard. All right, let's get started. Add that tension. We're here for two minutes now. Push, pull, push, pull. Let that beat carry you through. This song has a really nice beat that's easy to follow. Drive those heels down to the ground, shoulders down away from your ears, chest up. Breathe through it. 30 seconds in, 90 seconds to go, you got this. Find your pace. You should be working at a slower pace. Awesome, awesome job, everybody. One minute down, one to go. We're halfway. You got this. Push, pull. Our song's going to change here right away. Let it change into the next one. Push, pull, push, pull. We've got 20 seconds to go, finish it off. Then you're getting a 30 second recovery. Right through that song change. Nice work everybody. Thank you for joining me this morning. Three, two, one. Slow it down for 30 seconds. If you have just joined me, we just started our song, Want You Back, just so that you know. And we're going to be starting a four minute climb right away here. <laughs> Good morning, thank you. All right, 10 seconds. Again, we are on Want You Back. Go ahead and start that song. Let's get our four minute climb started here. Crank up that gear. You want this to be your heaviest one yet. So extra tension. If you took any off for that recovery, add it back, add extra. If you're on the treadmill or elliptical, make this steep. You want this to be a challenge for sure. All right, 30 seconds in already. Find your pace, challenge your body, you got this.
strong, even pedal strokes. All right, one minute down. We've got three minutes to go. Pace yourself. Listen to your body. If you ever need a recovery, take it. Join back in once you're ready. So awesome, everybody. Mind over matter. You are so much stronger than you think. Hang on to it. You are just about halfway. Keeping an eye on that posture. I know we're starting to get tired. All right, team, this is your halfway point. We've got two minutes to go. Our song is changing. This is such a good song. I'd love to change the world is what it's called, but it builds up really nicely. And since this is our heaviest part of the drill, it's nice and motivating. We've got less than two minutes to go. Keep that in mind. Challenge yourself the whole time. Finish it off. Crank up the song. Ninety seconds here, that's nothing. You can do it. If you want to make this extra challenging, add an extra quarter turn here. Just over a minute. Push those watts. Push yourself if you're on that treadmill. Finish off that hill. One minute to go, team. Right here. Push. So good. Thirty seconds, that's it, that's all. Finish it off. So good. Fifteen, right to the end. So good, Kinetic. Four, three, two, one. Recover. Grab some water. Take your recovery. You have earned it. Nice work. I love that song so much. Okay. Grab some water. We are headed into sprints once again to flush out those legs. So for this song, right when it starts, we start that first sprint. It's your nine to 10 out of 10 effort. You're gonna have light gear, but make sure that you're not bouncing in the saddle. First sprint, 45 seconds. Second sprint, one minute. Final sprint, it's about 42 seconds. It takes us right to the end of the song. In between both sprints, you have a 15 second recovery. So it's 45 seconds, 15 seconds off, one minute, 15 off, and then we'll just finish off the song, okay? So during those sprints, it's all out effort. Whatever you're on, you're all out sprinting, okay? So make adjustments that are fit for your machine. We're gonna get started right away here. So start adjusting that gear, because right when we hit play, we're into that first 45 second drill, okay? So add that tension, get ready for that sprint. If you're on the treadmill, make adjustments to your incline and we'll get started in three, two, one, 45 seconds. This song is called Roses. It is a remix. All out effort here. You're here for 45 seconds. Keep an eye on that posture. Strong, even pedal strokes. Finish it off, push. 
halfway. Good morning. Thanks for joining me. Keep going, 10 seconds, team. You'll hear the song goes really quiet when you're done. In three, two, one, recover. Slow it down for 15. Awesome, awesome job, everybody. Second sprint, one minute. Right here, let's go. One minute. Pick up that pace again. Drive through those heels. Strong, even pedal strokes. Shoulders down, tight core. Push, push, push. So awesome. Nice work, everybody. Push, push. Halfway right here. 30 seconds left. Hang on to it. Let that music push you through. Go, 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 go. Three, two, one. Slow it down. 15 seconds off. We've got one more to go. It's about 42 seconds. It'll take us right to the end of this song. Five, four, three, two, pick it up. Push, push, push. All out effort. This is an all out sprint. Those legs are talking to you. Flush them out. Go, 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 go. Right to the end of this song. You got this. Five, four, three, two, one. Flush it out. Woo. Amazing. Grab some water, everybody. We are heading into a pretty long climb next. So take your recovery. Our next drill is 11 minutes long and this drill is really it can be whatever you want to make it so it's going to be alternating from two minutes on one minute off two on one off there's four two minute segments and three one minute segments so there's some options here the two minutes you want to be a climb and if you're on a bike, you want to be seated. Um, if you're on the treadmill, you want it to be a consistent um, hill that you're going to be walking or running up. Then your one minute, you can either make that a sprint or you can make that a heavier gear, whatever is best for you, depending on what equipment you're on. But that one minute should be different than the two minute segment. And then when we come back to two minutes, we're going to make it a little bit heavier or a little bit steeper for that two minutes. The one minute can be whatever you would prefer. You could make it a heavier climb or you could make it a sprint or you could just take a recovery. It's totally up to you depending on what's best for the equipment you have or the mood that you're in. But the two minutes stays consistently a climb, but every round is going to get a little bit heavier than the last one or a little bit steeper if that makes sense. So I'll let you know when we're switching um, based on my timer, but if you want to set a timer and keep track, feel free. So it's two minutes with a climb, first climb. On the Schwimm bike, I'm going to be adding a full turn of gear. Depending on what your bike is, add what you need to. And for your treadmill, add a moderately steep hill, nothing too crazy yet, as you're going to make it steeper every round, okay? Feel free to take recoveries whenever you need them. You're more than welcome to use that minute as just a recovery to flush out your legs. Either way, you're still going to be getting a good workout in, so you just choose what's best for you depending on the equipment. Okay, let's get started. Our first song is Harley's in Hawaii. Um, I'm gonna hit play right now. Go ahead and hit play. Two minutes is starting on my timer. Again, add that tension. 
moderately heavy, probably about a six or a seven out of 10 effort here. It's nothing too heavy yet because we're going to be adding tension, but it should still feel like work to you. Find that pace. On the swim bike, your RPM should be under 75 for sure, but every bike is a little different. So you just don't wanna be going too fast. This shouldn't be anywhere near that race pace. It's a lot slower, it's a climb. So make sure you have enough gear that it's not allowing you to go any faster than that. We are one minute in, we've got one minute to go, and then we switch into a different uh, drill. Push, push. Thirty seconds to go, and then you've got one minute. You can choose what you do with that minute. If you want to make it a heavier climb, you'll add more gear or more incline. If you want to make it a sprint, you'll take that tension down, pick up that pace, or you could take this as a full recovery. It's up to you. 10 seconds away. Push, push. Three, two, one. One minute here, you choose what you do, whether it's a climb or a sprint, it's totally up to you. Feel free to stand for it. You're here for one minute, whatever you choose. Good morning. Halfway. In 30 seconds, we are going back into that climb, but this time it's going to be heavier for our two minute climb. So you're gonna add about a quarter to a half turn on your bike. Um, if you're on elliptical or treadmill, add a little bit more of an incline or whatever options you have on there. Just make it a little bit heavier. Three two, one. Our song has changed. I forgot to mention the next four songs are dedicated to this drill. So just let that playlist play through. We are here for two minutes. You're back in that seated climb now and you want to have a little extra gear than you did last time. So just add a little attention. Ride it out, push, pull, push, pull. Those legs should be talking to you. Take those recoveries whenever you need them. Awesome, awesome job, everybody. One minute down, one minute left. Push, pull, push, pull. Thirty seconds. In thirty seconds, we uh, stand for a minute or sprint for a minute have your climb for a minute or recover. It's totally up to you. That minute is yours to choose. You make whatever you want out of this drill. It's an 11 minute drill. We are just about five minutes into it. So we're approaching that halfway point. Hang in there. 10 seconds and we head into that one minute drill. Four, three, two, one, one minute here, add extra gear, take it off, pick up that pace, 
totally up to you. Our song's gonna change here. Keep riding. Push. Remember to take those recoveries whenever you need to. Listen to your body. Halfway, 30 seconds, we're back into that seated climb or that uh, treadmill hill. You're gonna add extra gear though for that two minutes. Make it heavier. 15, get ready for it. Keep an eye on that posture. Five, four, three, two, add a little extra gear. Here we go, two minutes. We are over halfway now. Push, push. Awesome, awesome job, everybody. Hang in there. Keep an eye on that posture as you get tired. Make it your priority. Shoulders are down away from your ears. Pushing in through those heels. Oh yeah, that's it. <laughs> All right, one minute down. We've got one minute to go. Awesome job, everybody. Keep it up, push. All right, team, in 30 seconds, we head into our final one minute drill, so. If you wanna switch it up, if you've been climbing for the last couple and you wanna bring it into a sprint, feel free. It doesn't have to stay consistent to what you've been doing. We've got one more to go coming up in 10 seconds. You choose whether you climb, sprint, or recover. Right here, one minute, push, push, push. Awesome job, everybody. We are almost done. We've got less than 10 minutes to go already. And this is our final song. It is Imagine Dragons again, Bad Liar, and it builds up really nice. So for that last two minutes, it will be perfect. We're heading into that portion in 30 seconds. You're gonna wanna make this your heaviest yet or your steepest yet, whatever that is to you. Make it hard. It's only two minutes. It's your last climb of the uh, class. Make it count. You are so much stronger than you think. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, here we go. Add that extra gear or incline, make this hard. Two minutes, that's it, that's all. Push. Seated or standing, finish it off. Crank up that song, let it motivate you. Push. Push, pull, push, pull, left, right, left, right. Right to the top of that hill. One minute down, one minute to go, you got this. Mind over matter. You are so much stronger than you think.
Hang on to it, team. 45 seconds. You got this. Push. Amazing. Keep it up. 20 seconds. That's it. That's all. Finish it. Fifteen, right to the end. Final ten. Keep going. Push, push. Five, four, three, two, one. Flush it out. Amazing. That was an 11 minute drill. You crushed that. So good. Okay, so for time, um, we're not gonna have time for our sprint, but since it's in my playlist, I'll still explain it. Um, for the Ceiling Can't Hold Us song, um, it would be one minute on, 20 seconds off for three rounds if you were to do that at home. But I'm just going to go ahead and skip into our ACDC song, so Highway to Hell. And this is your last song, so if it were to be in a normal class, I would tell you to hit your um, stage button and you'd see how far you can go in this time. But if you're able to see your distance on whatever machine you're using, then you could just set a goal for yourself. Um, and then throughout this drill, we're going to be adding tension every minute. Um, you're going to start at a moderate uh, gear and that you can choose if that is lighter or heavier it's up to you and then every minute we're going to be adding gear so we have three increases for this drill um, yeah if you can see your distance feel free to set a goal for yourself or set a goal in your my zone whatever you want um, to do to motivate you but this is your last drill of the class so make it count all out effort and let's get started go ahead and hit play on highway to hell and add that gear. I'm adding about a half or a full turn of gear to the bike. I'm gonna add a full turn, add whatever is equivalent to your machine, keeping in mind that we're going to be adding extra gear every minute or extra incline. Finish strong, this is your last drill. Make it count right to the end. We've got four minutes left of this class. Finish off that song. You guys did so good. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. Let's finish off this song strong. All out efforts. All right, team, add a little gear. Add a little incline. Add a little something, make it harder. Push, push, push. So good. Second increase coming up in thirty. Just about halfway through this song already. Push. All right, team, let's add that gear a little extra, about a quarter or maybe even a half turn. Make it a little steeper on your treadmill. We've got a minute and 20 seconds to go. Push. We add more gear in 30 seconds. Push. 
All out efforts. Go, go. Woo. Keep it up. All right, team, add that gear. Last increase. Push, push. 30 seconds left. Let's go. Fifteen seconds. Finish it off. So good. When that song finishes, recover, grab some water. I have included a cool down drill for you. So please feel free, take your time here, cool down for a sec. And yeah, thank you so, so, so much for joining me this morning. That was so nice to get back into um, a spin workout. It's been so long. I don't think I've gone this long without spin ever since I was like, like 16. So that's crazy. That was really hard. Thank you for joining me. It was nice to see you virtually. Um, and hopefully I'll get to see you again in the next couple of weeks. Stay safe, stay healthy. Bye.